It's 650 years since the first Stuart King of Scots ascended to the throne. Here's six facts on King Robert II. Robert was the seventh High Steward of Scotland, a position that dated back to the 12th century. The historical origins of the title lay in the role of the king's food bearer, but in practice it was the role of the officer who controls the domestic affairs of a royal household. After Robert became king in 1371, the title became bestowed to the heir to the Scottish throne. This means the current High Steward of Scotland is Prince Charles. He was the grandson of Robert the Bruce and was heir presumptive from 1318 to 1324 until Bruce's son David was born. He was regent multiple times during David II's reign. The first was from 1334 to 1341 when David II went to France for safety as he was still a child during the start of the Second Scottish War of Independence. Robert was given the role again when David II was imprisoned in England after being captured at the Battle of Neville's Cross in 1346. This lasted until 1357 when David was released from English captivity with the Treaty of Berwick. One thing Robert was very good at was ensuring a dynasty as he had lots of children. Legitimately, it is said he had 21 from his two marriages, but there were many more out of wedlock. His first marriage to Elizabeth Moore wasn't initially classed as legal by the church until he received a papal dispensation in 1347. When Robert became king in 1371, Scotland was still very feudal in its structure, and Robert changed the balance of power by installing his children into multiple earldoms across Scotland, either by claiming these or via marriage. It served him well for the first decade or so, but from 1384 onwards, the power waned via various coups and a loss of influence held by son John, Earl of Carrick, with the Scottish Earls. He is the first Stuart King. The surname his family had taken as part of the High Stuart title, and his descendants include Mary Queen of Scots, James VI of Scotland, first of England, Charles II, and even the current British monarch, Elizabeth II. The 1701 Act of Settlement was based on the Protestant descendants of the Stuart line. He died in 1390 at his beloved Dundonald Castle. It was the seat of the High Stewards of Scotland, and Robert built the present castle after his accession to the throne in 1371. Next time on Six Facts. He was the first Lord of the Treasury and the first man the UK thinks of as Prime Minister, Robert Walpole. If you like this video, please like it and share it with the hashtag TeamStructor. If you like the channel as a whole, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell so you know when a new video comes out.